Good morning. This is a new day. This is the new me coming to you live from my studio this morning. Oh my God, I am so excited today to talk to you. I just want to come to you this morning just to share a few things with you that I believe there was a famous uh, quote that Gandhi said, if you want to be the, if you want to see a change in the world, be the change that you want to see. I want to talk to you about change this morning. Change is good. So many times when change takes place, we get uh, afraid of change. We get discouraged with change, but change is good. Nothing stays the same. In order for a caterpillar to become a butterfly, it has to go into its cocoon and go through the metamorphosis of making the change. If we don't make the change, things will stay the same. If a body of water stays consistently, in one place, there's no flow for the water to flow through. It will become stagnant and it will not move. There has to be some moving in order for water to continue to flow to stay fresh. But if it stays in one spot for a long period of time, it becomes stagnant. And that's just how we are. If we stay in one place for a long period of time, we become stagnant in where we are. Good morning, Dimitri. It is good to hear from you this morning to know that you're watching if we stay in the same place and we're talking about change this morning be the change that you want to see in this world don't talk excuse me don't talk about it be about the change make a change bring something positive to somebody else's life don't talk about a man if you can't help pick him up don't talk about him make the change help make the change listen I also want to say to you this morning, if in your home, if you want to see a change take place in your home, don't try to change everybody else because you cannot change everybody else. The only person that you can change is you. You'll be the change. And when you begin to change, you'll see your situation change. When we pray and we ask God to fix this and to fix that, what are you asking God to do with you? How are you asking God to help you change? How are you asking God to help you with the beam that's in your eye before you try to take the moat out of somebody else's eye? How are you asking God to better you to be the better person that you can be today than you were yesterday. My goal for today is to feel better, to feel gooder than I did yesterday, to find more reasons to have fun than I did yesterday, to be more excited than I was yesterday, to feel good and to help someone else do better more than I did yesterday. My thing, my goal today is to be the better me than I was yesterday. So that means I have to change some things that I did yesterday to to amp it up a notch to boom there it is take it up a notch and be better today than I was yesterday because if I change then things my circumstances things around me have to change so this is the new me having a new day and I'm saying listen everything is working for you if you allow it to work but you got to put in the work you got to make the change you have to do something to make the change so this is the new me this is a new day and i'm coming to you live from my studio and i just want you to have a wonderful 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 day and give thanks for all things today remember to be grateful for everything that you have to appreciate everything that you have to be grateful for everyone that's in your life whether good or bad because even if they're not in the light that you want to see them in they're there for a reason you have to ask yourself what am i supposed to get or what am i seeing in this person that i am resonating with that i need to change in me so have a wonderful day and do be blessed this day for this is a new day this is the new me. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.